Hey, I'm Kurt Elster, and I want to show you how I do competitive analysis on a Shopify store. And what's great about Shopify is they're excellent at SEO. They're so good, they generate a sitemap.xml file for you automatically. And when you open that, you can see it contains more sitemaps for blogs, collection, pages, products. Actually, if you look at the top here, you just take the domain name, you go slash sitemap.xml. And once you got that, oh, okay, you decide what you want to see. And maybe I'm interested in seeing every product from a vendor. Or I am uh, I want to see all pages. Maybe I'm looking for some landing page inspiration. You know what? I think I am. So we're going to go to the pages sitemap. And here we go. We've got our, our sitemap here. And we can see like p slash pages slash drifting slash pages slash the exciters. Ooh, okay. I like it. This is giving me some info. So I'm going to select all of this and hit copy. And then I'm going to paste it into my text editor, TextMate. And I like TextMate because I can open up this menu that says text. And uh, let's see, I'm sorry, bundles, text, sorting, sort selection, and remove duplicates. Cool. And, okay, all right, we're getting somewhere here. If I take these lines out and take this out. Now I've got a bunch of URLs wrapped around the word LOC, loc, as in location. So I'm actually just going to find and replace those to get rid of them. Replace all. Oh, all right, those are gone. And I'm going to do it on this other one. All right, now I have a list of URLs, but I want to see all these really quickly. So I'm going to select all, hit copy. And if we look at my extensions, I've got this really cool one called copy all URLs. It lets you copy and paste a bunch of URLs. Ooh, and going backwards, uh, if you don't want to mess with a text editor like TextMate, like me, because I'm a big nerd, you may not be. You could use, I found this, uh, I googled it real quick, found it for you. It's called Text Fixer Remove Duplicate Lines. It looks like this website will do exactly the same thing. Okay, <sighs> we've got our URLs, and I've got this, this extension called Copy All URLs. So those URLs are sitting in my uh, clipboard. So I'm going to hit paste. Watch this. This is so fun. Come on. It's got to think. It's thinking. I need my, my thinking music. And look at that. See all these tabs loading in the background here? It just loaded all those URLs. Okay, sweet. So now I could start clicking through these, and I've got you know everything that any Shopify store has published publicly as a page. So here I know they're hiring, they've got these positions. Okay, we'll close this tab, move on to the next one. Wow, there's a lot of these. Oh, this is cool, a wide guide. So they must have, this must be like a common question, like oh, which, which sunglasses should I buy, the normal or the extra wide? And they have a printable size chart. Oh my gosh, their Black Friday landing page. This thing is awesome. That was like a giveaway. Oh, this is so cool. I'm sorry I missed this. I wonder what year that was from. Returns and exchanges. All right, I'm sure I could just find this on the website. That's not that exciting. What do we got here? Uh, some kind of crazy giveaway. This looks fun. The Pen15 Club. This is in the footer. I've seen this. Okay, so you get the idea. I mean, this thing... Oh, the college agent application. So you could do the same thing on... Uh, probably 99.9% .9 of Shopify stores. I tried it on the Tesla Shopify store. It did not work. So I know at least some of them it's been disabled. But if you've got that sitemap.xml, that tells you here's every page. Now, okay, this seems like we're hacking. We're really not because anything that's in that sitemap gets indexed by Google. But this is just a really convenient way to get all of it into your browser and quickly go through it for some inspiration.